everyone, so today I'm going to be sharing with you my evening skincare routine. So I like to first light a few candles and then slip into some comfy pajamas and slippers. So as you can see, I have on a full face of makeup that I have been wearing all day. So first I'm going to start out by tying my hair back with just any hair tie. And I'm going to be putting my hair into a ponytail, but a bun will work. Anything that will get your hair out of your face. And I just like to secure it in place. So now just to assure that my hair is pulled out of my face and stays out of my face, I'm going to be using this headband that I got from Target. And these are so similar to the MEJ hairbands that I have, but these ones are so cheap in comparison to how expensive the MEJ ones are. For my teeth, I'm just going to be using my toothbrush and my Crest Complete with Scope. And I'm just putting some on my toothbrush and brushing my teeth. And since this isn't so attractive, you don't have to watch the whole process. To remove my makeup, I'm going to be using my favorite makeup removing towelettes, which are the Garnier Refreshing Cleansing Towelettes. And usually one towelette does the job for my whole face, but if you have a little extra makeup on, you might want to use two. And I just wipe my eye makeup off first and then continue with the rest of my face. And these get pretty dirty. To cleanse my face, I'm going to be using the Origins Checks and Balance Cleanser and just a wet washcloth. And I'm going to be using my fingers tonight to apply this. You only need a little bit and this foams up amazingly. I still love the Cetaphil cleanser, but for right now this is my favorite at the moment. It leaves your skin feeling so clean and so fresh with a little bit of minty scent to it. And I just feel like so refreshed and renewed after I cleanse with this and my skin definitely feels clean now. Next, with a little cotton round or cotton ball, I'm going to be applying my Witch Hazel onto my face. And right now I'm using this as kind of like a toner. Um, it's just an astringent. And I think that this works great for drying up any excess oil that I have on my face in my T-zone um, or on any acne spots that I have. And it's so cheap and I love it. To moisturize my skin, I'm going to be using my Garnier Moisture Rescue Refreshing Gel Cream for my moisturizer and I like this because it's thick but it's still a gel so it's not too heavy on your skin and I feel like it gives me good moisture without being too heavy at night and causing breakouts or anything like that and it's also like it says in the name very refreshing. Right now for eye cream I am using the Origins Plant Scription Anti-Aging Eye Treatment and I just got this in a sample and I'm really liking this. I don't really have an eye cream that I'm using particularly right now that I like so um, if you know one and would like to share that you like, I would love to know what that is so I can purchase one. I do like the plant scription one. I just like to pat it under my eye. I like this because I feel like it does a good job of locking in the moisture under my eye area. Now to floss, I like to use these flossing sticks by Oral-B with Scope. Now for my favorite part of my skin routine for acne, I use the Mario Badescu Drying Lotion and a Q-Tip. And I like to apply this on any of my acne spots. As you can see, I have quite a few at the moment. And so you're just going to dip your Q-tip all the way down into the pink powder at the bottom and then pull it out. And you make sure you don't want to mix the um, liquid and then the powder because, I don't know, you're just not supposed to. So I just like to apply this to any spots that I have breakouts. And it's not so cute, but if you're doing it at night, then no one will see. And I feel like this really helps to dry up any acne that I have. Now to moisturize my lips, I'm just going to be using Vaseline. Um, I love the way this feels on my lips, and so I apply it on them at night. I really think that this moisturizes them and makes them so soft. And I also like to take a little bit and apply it to my eyelashes to condition them. I think that this really helps with conditioning your lashes and making them grow long and healthy. But make sure you rinse it all the way off the next morning. And that's all for my face. So right before I go to sleep, I like to apply this Glycerin Hand Therapy um, Hand Cream, and this is in number 25, and I love this because it makes my hands so super soft and moisturized, and the scent of the lotion just kind of puts me to sleep. It's so amazing. Then I just like to crawl in bed with a good magazine or my favorite book at the moment, and that is all. So good night, everyone, and thank you for watching. Bye, guys.